Today on Live Street Fails, we take a look at the top 20 wrong moments that were caught on Twitch TV. Now we have a lot of clips to get through, so we've got to jump right into it. Okay, so this live streamer was complaining that she had blackheads on her nose. Her dad watches her live stream and decided to give her something to help with it, only it does something like this. So my dad, because he watches my stream, he knows me a little bit more than I want him to. And he gave me this, and... So, when you turn it on... As you can see, it looks like something used for anything other than blackhead removal. This clip went viral and everyone assumed it was what it looks like it is, but let her explain what it actually is, or rather, let her dad explain what it is. Let's have a look. I just explained my dad that there's a clip on Reddit of me, because he gave me like something to suck out the blackheads and whiteheads off the nose. It's like a thing, you put it on the nose, and then all the, all the dirt is um, getting out of the nose. And I put it on so it vibrates because it's a it's a machine and i put it in front of the stream and i was like oh yeah it's a gift from my dad and of course everyone's like vibrating gift from dad holy shit blah 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 blah, blah. and then i had to explain myself no it's for skincare okay three more ones, like okay my dad wants to say something it's a dildo what the fuck <laughs> what the fuck <laughs> Dirty minds. We can't. We can't change it. <laughs> so during this whole pandemic, obviously everybody is really concerned about health and safety. Free God shows you exactly what not to do when you are cleaning the dishes for several housemates. Let's have a look at how he does. Yo, Nick. Yo. Fuck you, Nick. Fuck you, dude. <laughs> oh, boo-hoo. <sighs> Switch off the stream, then. It was the weekend, and this live stream house were talking about what they should get up to in Austin that night. They decided they should go into the city to pick up some middle-aged schoolgirls. Let's have a look. Yeah, we could do it. From ACL, like... Not just 6th Street is closed, like everything's closed. Wait, ACL as well, there's a bunch of girls, girls down there. Like, so like, Dude, in high school, middle school, it's what all- What? No! No, 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 that, I, I'm, that's, why, that's why I'm saying I don't want to go! I'm saying, I'm saying I don't want to go! What do you mean? I'm saying I don't want to go! I am saying I do not want to go! What do you mean? Idiot. I'm telling you- This live streamer got trolled really hard by his viewers off his chat when he received a donation asking the streamer to give a shout out to his friend Mac Miller for being 140 days sober. For those unaware, he actually passed away from an overdose 140 days ago, so I guess in one way or another he has been 140 days sober, but the streamer doesn't get it. Let's have a look. I'm getting trash. I just want to like, give trash. a quick shout out to Mac Miller for being 140 days sober. No. Big milestone. Yo, Mac Miller, shouts out to you, brother. That is fucking awesome. Keep it up. Have a drink tonight. You earned it. Just kidding. Your daughter would be very disappointed. Right, here Five months watching your streams with the oh, husband. Oh, Mac Miller's dead? Thanks for the chuckles. Oh, Love no. Piazzas. I didn't even put that. I love Mac Miller. Oh, I didn't even put that together. That that's who you, I still. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> I thought I thought he meant like. I Mitch Jones was browsing through his WoW characters on different servers when he completely forgot about a tune that he made on another server with a really offensive name. Obviously, you cannot show this sort of thing on live stream. It can get you banned and give you a bad reputation for it. Let's have a look. Get a rinse. Okay, why missed the cord? I don't, I don't see you, dude. I don't see you. Wait, let me delete one of my characters real quick. I went back on my demon hunter. Oh, sh dude, that's get the. F why is this on my account? Yo, no one saw that, bro. I, I literally, no one saw that. Okay, uh, bro. I, I don't think 
anyone's gonna yeah. give you gold anyway. Yeah, like, wait, they, they might. They mo dude, I, I don't think there's gonna be anyone on Wymer Secor that has yeah. any gold. I'm gonna be honest. Well, this live streamer was playing a virtual reality game called Beat Saber. Basically, you have music and beats that come at you, and with a physical VR controller, you have to hit the beats away. This live streamer messed up his audio, and it didn't play any of the audio that he could hear. So all you can hear is him breathing while he tries to play the game. Let's have a look. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I muted the wrong thing. I didn't. So the puppet was also playing this VR game when he ran into literal children. He ran into this kid who must have been three or four years old because he could barely speak English when his slightly older brother convinces him to do this. Let's take a look. The button. I, I said I was gonna push the button, but you said you weren't ready. Are you ready? Yep. You're ready now. I'm okay. totally ready. All right, we're ready. Now, now, don't ruin this game for me. Okay. Fuck you. I need louder. Fuck you. Louder. Fuck you. <laughs> You're making hands, man. I I don't even wanna. I don't even wanna go on. Okay. I'm on a. Oh, my sensor's all messed up. Mitch Jones was hanging out with some real-life friends, having some lunch, when he made a comment towards one of his friend's girlfriends. It was a rather offensive comment because this was her reaction to it. Let's have a look. Dude, you look like you suck a mean dick. Is this true? Mitch! that's really offensive. It's fucking offensive as fuck. <laughs> she probably gets angry into it. <laughs> She's like, <laughs> Okay, so No Sleep TV was dancing in a bathroom in Japan when one of the customers for this place came into the bathroom to use the toilet. He awkwardly interrupted the live stream, and this happened. Let's have a look. Lit up the sucker, and now let's see you. Let me see you. Oh, sorry. I was just, I was just uh, dancing uh, in here. Okay, have a nice party break. So the Poppin was rock climbing with some friends and there were some kids around because it was a family friendly place. He told his friends to not say anything bad when this happens. Cool, let's go. I'm going to yeah, school. go to school, Mitch. All right. Determination, man. Hey, 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 Mitch. Mitch, just one thing. There's a little girl over there with her mom. Don't cuss. Just don't yell, at least. Don't, come on, man. I, just, I got you, I got you. Just don't yell any cuss words. Just look. She'll grow up nice. She's seven. Can you climb? Shut up, just climb. I'm saying she'll grow up nice. That's okay, a, sure, just climb. Genetics, I can okay, see. just please. That's not even, it's not bad. This live streamer received a donation to eat dog food. So he did just that. He went downstairs, grabbed his pet's food and brung it up. And instead of just eating it out of a bowl or a plate, he decided that he would play the part and eat it out of his dog's container. Let's have a look. This is so disgusting and there's so much. Some ketchup? <laughs> <sighs> Uh, 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 but maybe it tastes better, you know? Oh! Oh, God! God! Oh! Oh, Bob! Oh! Mmm!
Amaranth was laying down and playing with her dog when this moment happened. It looks really bad from this point of view, but I can assure you it is not what it looks like. And she's actually quite a good pet owner compared to some people I've seen on Twitch. So if you think what it looks like is actually happening, I can assure you, at least with Amaranth, it most likely isn't. Hey what's up guys and welcome back to another episode of Twitch Fails. Now we have a lot of good clips to get through today so let's jump right into it. Okay so during this gaming tournament somebody in the audience actually had a controller that was connected to the PlayStation. The member of the audience was discreetly clicking the menu button over and over to annoy them and just when they had enough of that he decided to shut down the machine. Let's take a look at the crowd's reaction. Oh. Whoa! And that is at the fault of the players but luckily yeah. they're gonna get right through it. You, you it the middle of the controllers. Yes. Okay, looking Ooh. good, looking good. And tried something there. Maybe that's what he was trying. That. And this is now the second time. This is the fault of the players. It's the fault I am going to the blow them up. It is and the fault of the players. Whoa! Putting the PS4 in the rest mode. Wow. Who did, someone did that on purpose. Wow. That's, that's a... Wow. That's hilarious. Someone just did that on purpose. Wow. Wow. Okay, so RuneScape just had an update, so RuneScape decided to do a live stream to display the update to everybody who plays the game. While showing off the update and showing all the new NPCs, this member of Jagex accidentally misgenders an NPC. Another member of Jagex is quick to jump the gun and fix his mistake and let him know that he has misgendered one of the new NPCs. Let's take a look at his reaction. Rest over here by the shop. And this guy right here will teach you how to create the brand new Super Anti-Fire Potions. Uh, is it a woman? <laughs> this, is it a woman? Is that a woman? I am so sorry. That does not look, it's a gnome. It's, I'm sorry. Um, it's a woman, evidently, that will teach it. Let me just zoom in. That is a woman uh, who, will, <laughs> who will evidently teach you how to make the new super anti-fire potion. I'm sorry. I didn't know. Um, so <laughs> okay, so this live streamer was doing an ASMR stream and trying to chill out with the chat, but pay close attention to the bottom right of her screen because her dog walks in, interrupts the ASMR session to use the bathroom. Let's take a look. This Counter-Strike player was playing some ranked and his friend was clutching. His friend pulled off a clutch that was so disgusting to him that it somehow made him vomit. I don't really understand how that works, but let's have a look. <laughs> okay, so this live streamer was having a serious discussion with her chat about politics, but it was hard to take her so seriously when her dog came into the background and started humping her pillows. Let's have a look. Or get angry at you. And, you know, for me, there's... I totally lean more towards the right. But I will be happy to hear your opinion and, you know... That's basically it. Like, it is what it is. I guess it's not. What is she doing? <gasps> Boo -boo! Okay, so this live streamer was trying to shotgun a drink for the first time, and he had no idea how to do it. He almost stabbed himself with a knife multiple times, and when he finally got to it, it exploded all over him and his furniture. Let's take a look. Alright, here you go, dude. Use your goddamn shotgun. God damn. I don't think this is the right way to do it, dude. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Dude. Okay, so this live streamer was playing some VR chat, and on VR chat, it shows what your estimated height is through the trackers and such. And this live streamer's height, which was five foot three, got exposed on his live stream. Let's take a look at his reaction. 
We're Americans, aye, aye, please. Aye. I am not five three. Stop, dude. You're short. I'm not that short. I thought I was five six. What? You can recalibrate it. It's Cry. Okay. That's not funny, dude. Okay, so this live streamer was also playing some virtual reality and he ran into a little kid. The little kid was so young and then his dad came in and went off at him for using his microphone. I guess he wasn't allowed to be playing this game. Let's have a look. You don't like the big guy? What? Why don't you like the big guy? I told you don't use your mouth! Okay, so this live streamer shaved his head on his live stream. Now everybody in the chat was telling him that he did a pretty good job and it was nice and even until they confessed that they were lying. Let's have a look at his reaction. Middle of head, bottom right, at neckline. I can't see, man. This doesn't help. The mirror helped better. While playing some VR chat, this live streamer ran into somebody who was literally getting yelled at by his dad. His dad was going off at him because he was being way too loud at 11 o'clock at night. The live streamer and all of the players on the server gathered around in a circle to listen to his dad go off at him. Let's have a look. <laughs> Alright, I'll stop yelling. I'm sorry, dad. You're kind of short. <laughs> Alright. All right, Dad. I'm I'm really sorry. I, okay, my dad's mad at me, guys. <laughs> my dad's <laughs> my dad's hey, mad at me. Up. That's really funny. It's I'm eleven o'clock, and my neighbor my neighbors are knocking yelling. on my door. And my dad's yeah, mad at me. Yeah, I just straight up heard your dad talking to you in the background. Okay, so this couple was doing some challenges on their live stream. If they hit certain milestones, they would do a challenge. His challenge was to eat this really disgusting food, which he did. Except it came right up instantly. Let's have a look. They gave us, it was five dollars for this, but then they get twenty more. You know what? You went above and beyond. I go above and beyond. Okay, so this live streamer just came back from shopping and he got into his car to drive away. Now he forgot that he was parked behind one of those concrete barriers that you can't just drive through. You have to reverse out of it. And because he forgot that there was one in front of him, he literally drove over it. Let's have a look. Okay, let's go look for a Korean restaurant. Korean restaurant or Chinese restaurant. Oh, that's hard to see. No way. Oh God. Oh, did I have my car? No! This live streamer was playing a game with his friends when his friend, for no reason at all, just throws up into his microphone. His girlfriend quickly has a go at him for it. Let's have a look. This live streamer was way too immersed in the game of VR because somebody threw a table at him. He thought it was so realistic that he tried to dodge the table in real life and accidentally knocked himself down onto the ground for it. Let's take a look. Oh, 
The developers of World of Tanks were playing and live streaming together when they accidentally got themselves permanently banned from the game. It's pretty funny because they actually created this game, they are the developers for it, and they got themselves banned on their own game. Let's have a look at their reaction. Maybe you should ask the guys to kill you actually. Probably gonna be easier. Because now I'm dead, but now you're not. Nope! Ah! <laughs> Gentlemen, <laughs> we're having some technical difficulties oh getting this whole God. thing to run. Unfortunately, uh, unfortunately, it's a little bit problematic today. I'm not quite sure. Like, okay, we did this last time and it worked perfectly, right? Let's just do. Okay, I'll accept you guys. Oh, I just gotta get some water because my voice sounds like Marty. <laughs> <laughs>